Welcome back viewers. Today I'll be solving this mind-blowing Olympiad question. Now let's solve the equation on the left-hand side before moving to that on the right-hand side. So solving this, we're going to have x plus 1 over x equals to the square root of 2. Now I'm squaring both sides to eliminate the square root. Now I'm going to have x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 2 times 1 over x times x okay it's like expanding the bracket and here i'm going to have what i'm going to have 2 so here yeah, s divide by x okay so on the next line we're going to have x squared plus 1 over x squared equals to 2 minus 2 moving these two to the next um, to the right hand side so here I'm, i will be having x squared plus 1 over x squared equals to 0 now multiplying both sides by x squared okay left hand side and the right hand side here i'm going to have x to the power of 4 plus 1 equals to 0 and here I'm having s to the power of 4 equals to negative 1. Now, let's just um, save this equation for now. Now, coming to the right equation on the right hand side, rewriting the equation on the right hand side, here I'm going to have, rewriting x to the power of 29 as s to the power of 28 multiplied by x to the power of 1, which is still the same thing plus 1 divided by x to the power of 28 multiplied by x so here yeah, x to the power of 28 is the same thing as x to the power of 4 times 7 which is still 28 multiplied by x plus 1 over x to the power of 4 times 7 outside what i use there is the rule of indices okay and we've gotten x to the power of 4 to be negative 1. So here I'm going to have negative 1 to the power of 7 times x plus 1 over negative 1 to the power of 7 times x. Um, negative 1 to the power of 7 is still negative 1 times s is going to give me negative x plus 1 over negative x. Now, factorizing the negative sign out, here I will be having x plus 1 over x. And don't forget that x plus 1 over x is the same thing as square root of 2. So this shows that here, finally, I will be having, um, finally, my answer is going to be negative square root of 2. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Please, if you find this very interesting, comment and also subscribe. Thank you.